Hi, I'm Chad Byler here at the U of I Track and Field Stadium with head coach Mike Turk. Coach, uh, after a long day, what are your thoughts on, uh, first, the javelin throw? You had three guys with a PR. Uh, what specifically did you see out of them? Well, they threw far. Um, they had great performances. They've been good in practice, and this has been coming along. We saw a little breakthrough last week with, with Ben Dodds, and uh, Ben certainly threw well again tonight. And Aaron uh, Wilkes had a big breakthrough. Uh, as well, and, and George Wade is the first time he's thrown javelin in a couple of weeks. So, um, you know, it was a great performance for those guys. I think the atmosphere of being up inside the stadium here under the lights was a big part of that. I think it really uh, helped motivate them and, and uh, put them in a good environment to perform well. Mm -hmm. And then the 4x4 four four was one of your four victories today. Last year you had 4x4 uh, four four went to NCAAs. You've had a little bit of a regroup and reload with that group set a season best today what exactly did you see out of them well we're making some progress and one of the things we did was uh, we changed the lineup a little bit and uh, we moved uh, Kenneth Allen to the third leg and and we ran Cam Viney fourth and uh, they're probably our two most experienced guys and and I think the uh, the two other guys that we ran on there Matt Burns and and Kevion Aikens both have uh, been improving and, and progressing along. So we felt comfortable with those guys running the first two legs. And it kind of allows us uh, to put our, our best guys on the last two legs where they can kind of chase some people. And, and I think the sum of that is a little bit better. So we definitely made some progress there. And then the distance guys had a uh, number of PRs and a couple runner-up finishes. Uh, what, what are you and also Coach Stewart seeing out of that group? Well, I think the young guys in the distance program are really performing well. Uh, you know, Conrad Arian in the in the 800, another, I mean, the guy just seems like he's PRing every week now, and every race looks a little bit better than the one before it. Uh, Trevor Cure had a nice PR tonight in the 800 as well. Um, you know, Jesse Reiser in the, in the 1500, he's come a long way. I mean, he's really on the threshold of running a, a really fast 1500, so... Uh, the young guys have really kind of stepped up and started to you know, rise uh, to the occasion, and, and uh, they're improving by leaps and bounds right now, which is something that we really need. Finally, you're, you're coming up on the end of the, the regular season. you got Drake Relays uh, next week. What are your overall thoughts on how this, the team as a whole performed tonight, looking ahead towards the next week or so? Well, good. We we were uh, we're in a good spot here with this meet. I, I think the uh, the weather was pretty good, but I, I think it's just a good atmosphere to be in the twilight. And you know, we got the lights on, and the wind dies down, and and they really enjoyed it. And um, you know, last couple of years we've had good performances here in this meet, so I think we're in a pretty good spot moving into Drake. So uh, you know, we still have some health issues that we're working through, <clears throat> but uh, you know, we're close and uh, we're progressing. So I think we're in pretty good shape. Thanks, Coach. For more on Fighting Illini men's track and field, go to FightingIllini.com.